guys that was tech Joe breaker here today and in my in this video i'm gonna be showing you guys individual tweak and that is also like a legacy edition um if you guys want you guys can go ahead and check out the full tweak list in the description below it's not been fully uploaded yet but if you guys want you guys can go and check it out uh i think it's almost uploaded now but uh but yeah also guys this is my battery charger i don't know if you guys wanted to see my battery charger uh here you go uh here's my battery charger i'm gonna go and see that so I'm going with the first tweak, and that is App Switcher. Um, so, no, not tweak, more of a settings, but uh, you get the few options. You could do pagination, which more or less what it is, is it lets you um, kind of change um, how many pages you allow. You can preview such open up specific applications. Uh, you know, you can close apps, you can tap to hold, close all, and you can even close all apps, you take over the App Switcher. And then in the end, you can even get an option to show the active app. All right, that's part of the app switcher area. And then in here, you go to uh, auxiliary pages, uh, right? And then just put them up, see that. Uh, and then in here, what you guys can do, you guys do options. You guys can affect the playback. How do you guys want the playback to be? Do you want it to be uh, what volume slider? You get the uh, get the track server. You get the airplane, the airdrop, double rock. You can even get the um, you can uh, swap the auxiliary page order. And in advanced options, you can affect um, how to open it up, where to open it up, either play, open up to playback, uh, visible pages, and if not, hide playback. Um, I think I recommend you guys keep this one on because probably this is probably the most important part um, about this tweak in general. Alright, so that's about it for that specific settings. That's going to show you guys the real tweak. That's it, guys. Here you go. Here's the tweak. Um, you get your toggles on the top, you get the airdrop right here, scroll down, and uh, you get the working flashlight, so you get a clock, you get night nice shift, which does work, you get a calculator, which does work, um, you even get the camera, which uh, which does work, so, um, scrolling back in here, yeah, so just, see, it does work perfectly. Alright, so it does work really fine, guys. That's about it for that part of the tweak. Let's go and swipe over to the YouTube area and uh, push media controls. And in here, what you guys can go ahead and do is really simple. Um, you guys can try to, you know, affect it out. So, what I'm going to do, guys, right now is going to open it up. Here you are in this specific area. What you're going to go ahead and want to do is um, just play any song, any music. I'm going to go ahead and open up Spotify here. Um, play this song all right so it's right now playing in the background of let see album right there go and tap on the name it will take you directly to the uh, time scroll which I just think it's awesome uh, all right now in here you get the little small application go and click on it and open up the application I just think has an app button enough torture right, that's about it for that area swiping over you get the uh, you get the app switcher as I said let's go and swipe down and it closes up the application I'm going to open up Safari here, for example. I was on the Jailbreak Me website because apparently, as you guys can now see, uh, Apple has officially revoked the uh, developer enterprise, so we can't Jailbreak anymore. So, whatever. Alright, so guys, here we are in here. Let's open up the control center. Alrighty. Alright. So you guys, is the control center. Uh, it looks actually pretty fashionable. I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, not that bad, actually, to be honest. Uh, you know, you get your name right there. Let me write this just a little bit more. Uh, you get, you know, you get your name and everything right there. You get a little small scrubber here. Um, the only difference is that you get both. So you get the time and you also get the um, volume. So you got toggles on the side. You know, you get everything the way it was supposed to be. And um, with this tweak, you can even, in um, the horizontal mode, you even get airplane mode, which I just think is awesome. So get all that, and then go ahead and come in to the next page, is the full-on true horizontal app switcher. This is the only app switcher you will ever get on iOS, um, on, on an iPhone, because the only time you can actually get horizontal app switcher, and that's through here. So just can see again swipe down and then you swipe up again obviously to open it up 
it won't work at the top on it for it to open up but if it's on vertical mode like it is right now just can see go uh, double tap don't work perfectly go and go here uh, just can see it you have to, you have to slide up it, uh, it is a little bit laggy at the moment uh, not sure if they patched this already but you have to see there uh, you can open up some sort of application I'm going to look at media here or activator as you can see here it works perfectly fine uh, opens up perfectly uh, that's about it for this tweet guys you know this video thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it subscribe for more this is the best tweet I like to do hope you guys enjoy it um, and yeah guys so subscribe for more and uh I'm doing my talk right now. Alright. Yeah, guys, so sub subscribe for more. All links in the description below. Thumbs up if you guys enjoyed this video. Um, give a like if you guys think Joe Breaking is awesome. Because that would be mean the world to me. Um, but yeah, so. Yeah. Thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.